Welcome back to the Crooked Caber. <laughs> I have one friend that keeps uh, recommending games to me. Like, half the games I've played on my channel is from this one friend. And he got this for me for Christmas. And I'm playing it. Uh, and we are going to decide if it is scary and fun, or just scary and not fun, or fun and not scary. Play new game. So, how are you feeling? Do you feel these sessions are still helping? You could try something a little more... Uh, direct? We could start in vivo exposure therapy. I'd go for some therapy. Massage therapy. Ooh. Oh, surprise, a little corgi. Hello. Hi. Do I have issues? Is this my... <laughs> it's like heaven. Uh, you just get one corgi assigned, and you get sent to, like, America, suburbia. This is the dream. It's what I would want to do. All that white, fluffy little... I wish I had one of these. I would thirst greatly. ASMR. Uh, come, little bravo doggy. I shall name you Doily. Doily the dingo dog. Oh. Okay, okay. <laughs> I know it's gonna get me. Again, I, I play these sorts of games because I, I cannot bear like the horror of something that looks real. So if it looks like doo doo, I won't be scared of it. That's the kind of like thought here. Doily, doily. Let's keep going, doily. How much you wanna bet he's just gonna like yoink himself into a sewer? I don't need a dog. Oh. Okay. Oh. oh, examine. I can't just leave. Yes, I can. I have to. Her? What would you do? <laughs> what would you do? Do you have any idea how heavy these manholes up here are? Bear. I bare fingered the grate and lifted that thing up. That's, a, that's near impossible, I would say. Sir Stabs. Arcane. Ooh, Discord. You know what? I'll do it for Doily. Oh, man. Oh, man. I'd call for help, though, is what I would do. I would call, um, like, city services and be like, My dog! My dog got flushed away in the sewer! And they'll be like, flushed away? What a great movie. And I'll be like, no! Oh, I can kind of, like, move quicker. I wonder if there's a limit. I'm gonna, I'm gonna speed walk forward, like I'm at the ball. Just gonna give it a little speed walky walk. Mm. Oh. oh, I hate that. I have, like, no sense of direction from, like, sound, so I have no idea where that came from. Can I, like, gerbil feed this? <laughs> I mean, it looks pretty clean. Look at it. That's not clean. That's <laughs> clean water. I'd be kind of thirsty. Oh, man. Dr. Blal out. I don't know whether to be like thankful that I have a friend that like gets me these games or to be sad. Okay. That's where I came from. Um I'll choose to be thankful. I'll choose to be thankful. Until like something comes out. I make the thumbnails before uh I, I film the video. So like for example, I already know like one of the things in this game. And it's that weird, like, hand-eye thing, which I'm not, I'm not happy about. I saw that. I looked up, like, maybe, like, a brief image just from the game to use. Which is dangerous. Very good way to get spoilers. Demon monster, are you here? Demon little boo-boo bear? Oh, I hate that. Um, tragically hipster. Hey, nah. You cut that out. Oh, man. I have an inventory. <gasps> a 
flashlight, an old military flashlight. I always keep it with me in case I get trapped somewhere. I can't bear to leave the house without it. The batteries are long lasting and had guaranteed to last all game written on the package. Whatever that means. Oh well, yay, it means it won't go out, unless it does. Um, which, that wouldn't be very uh, happy to. Ah, little sledgy sledge. See, now if the uh, the finger face monster comes, we can uh, assault and assail it. Ugh, oh, <laughs> the good old double A. Assail. Ah, uh, okay. Well, this is staying out. I'm a fighter, guys. I'm a fighter. You put me in the sewer. You put you put baby in a bunny rabbit hole. I'm going to go swinging. I, if I get eaten alive, it's going to be by something that I hit. That's for sure. Hello. Chupacab. Oh, a bed. Oh, a couch. I would act. Oh, is that meat? Delicious. I would be here in a second. There's not much on the TV nowadays. So I thought I'd make my own show. I started putting food and rancid meat and the useless old box and all sorts of little critters would come and play. It was really relaxing to just sit on the sofa and watch them eat. But the small critters started attracting larger ones to the show. Some horrid putrid thing kept coming by to watch. So I would just pretend to be asleep until it passed. But I think it knows I'm awake. I think it's watching me, not the show on the TV. That's a point. Oh my goodness. Marinade me like a saucy little steak with that one. Oh. Oh. I, mm. you know, oftentimes in these games, it's not like the horror itself that gets me. It's the, uh, it's the knowing that something's coming. My eyes... All they can do now is sting and show me stuff that can't be real. If that rancid thing wants them, then I say let it have them. It's the finger face. <laughs> it's the finger face. I know it is. Okay, finger face, come on. All I can do is face you. Oh, crap. Oh, dear. If I start, like, panicking, which probably will happen, because I knew the second I looked at this game, it was going to be, it was going to be a rough one. Um, and I, I play the games like the... Ah! Sacre bleu Japon! Oh! Oh, I can fight! Oh. Is that music, or is that something coming towards me? <laughs> well... I'm a fighter is what I am. You got any loot, son? I would leave immediately. That would be the end of my adventure searching for my dog. Boo Boo Bear! Come here! I'll fight them all! What the? No, Boo Boo, come back! We're not playing that game, Doily. There's things in here. There are things in here. Doily. 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 Okay, we're playing Doom now, son. I gotta get into the mindset. Because if I don't get into the mindset, I'll be too scared to act. You see, this is... I, I'm a motivational speaker. This is how you're supposed to act. You just gotta be so balls to the walls. Keep talking and don't stop talking. And don't let the fear have a chance. I'll let you in on a little secret. If you keep talking, your mind can't think. All hope abandon. Ye who enter here. Oh dear. Oh. Oh. <laughs> We're entering the booty hole of abandonment. Oh no. Well, it said to abandon all hope. I'm sorry. I think. I think. I think <laughs> the booty hole of abandonment. <laughs> Would have been uh, the moment that I decided to get a cat or something. I hope there's nothing in here. My guess is this game is about some sort of like mental illness. <laughs> Woo! Yeah, not meant to fight that. I hate that right there. Come on. Come on. 
Come on, keep going, keep going, keep going. And there's like no nest. Okay, come on. There is a slug in the booty hole. Is it coming? I guess let's not find out. Hello? Damaged handgun. <laughs> An eyeball. I don't know. I didn't notice the handgun, but you know, if we get to shoot something later, I'm down. What is there something down here? We are in the inner processing of someone's butt. And I'm not okay about it. Go, you borky dorky doily! It's one of these, isn't it? Um. Okay. Oh, save. Oh, that means I can... I can die now. <laughs> oh no, that means I'm in danger. <laughs> Gotta love that. Huh. Doily, am I safe in here? Doily. I perceive that finger face is gonna come like eat me at some point. Some point soon. Ugh. Oh look, it's um, we played that game. Oh, what's down here? Oh, I think Finger Face is here. Oh no, Doily! I hate you! Give me my dog! Doily! Doily is just fine. Well, I think it's too late to leave now. Now, now we're like outlasted. We're here. Uh. Oh, I feel kind of safe in here, actually. Hello. Oh. Open the station. You know what's going to happen if I open the station? What do you mean? Oh, no. Oh, no. Mm-hmm. I hope you know the Gaga yet who's in here now. And he is hungry. Oh, did I just open a train? Is there something I need to be uh, scared of? Oh, sacre bleu. Okay, let's get ready to fight. As long as I got this hammer, I think I feel okay. I want my gun. You give me a gun in any of these games. Like, Resident Evil wasn't even scary. Because, you know, I could, um... Are we going the wrong way? It looks like we're going that way. Yeah, that way. That's not where Doily went. We were. Ashu! Where are you, son? You want some? I'll toss your sauce. You want to enter the train of pain? I don't want to go. I just want to stay on this train. I want to stay in the dark where no one can see me. What the doggy doo doo is going on? Hmm. Yeah, I'm getting lighthouse vibes. Except in the lighthouse, I had a shotgun. <laughs> One can only hope. Okay, what's here with me? Huh. Hello? Oh, holy Resident Evil. Oh! <gasps> Hello! Nice. Mm. 
It was too big. <laughs> it was too big. It's too big for me. And I'm too easily spooked. Because, like, I'm just, I'm playing the game, like, hoping he never shows up. Why is that broken? Restrooms, hello? Any drug dealers in here for me to... David, Ian. Oh, I hate that. Does that mean it can, like, follow me in here? I'm going to leave these open so that if I need to run in here quickly and hide in a stall, I can. Ruger ammo. Please give me the gun. I desperately want it. A damaged, a damaged handgun. Can I? Oh! <laughs> it says damaged. It will fire, won't it? I'm not willing to try because I want to like preserve the ammo. Okay. Okay. I feel I feel so much better now. We're not playing. We are not playing. I am glocked up. I am suddenly very happy. I don't know what to do. I, I'm not happy. Oh, they're so ugly. And everyone treats them like they're not real. They're so pretty and perfect and they all have friends, but I'm just here. This is a game about depression. This finger face, the, 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 mm. <laughs> yeah, I don't know, mate. Someone has, someone got hungry. Yum, 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 yum. Some baby back ribs, son. It's just Resident Evil. That's what it feels like. Huh. Well, I definitely want to turn that off. It was a slow day when it happened. Only two trains even stopped here, and I didn't see her until it was too late. I heard her sobbing as she walked down the tracks. I wanted to run and save her, but I could hear the train. I just waited and listened. She must have regretted it at the last moment because I heard a scream. I can't stop her. She passes through the walls. All I can do is wait and listen. Why did I do that? I used all my bullets on a single target. How fun was that? <laughs> She's coming through the walls. I shouldn't have done that. Woo! Oh! Oh! You know what, honey? Boom! 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 I don't know what your deal is, but I don't like it! <gasps> We're running now. See, that's what this game has become. That's what all the, our games become. It's just, it's just a running fest. You just get to a point where you just keep running. Although, I'd rather have her than finger face. How long is this game? <laughs> I'm scared. <laughs> oh. I'm gonna go back and not use all my ammo. <gasps> oh, yeah. Oh, oh, oh. oh, it's a shooter. I didn't think it'd be a shooter. Oh, how nice is that? Oh, I feel suddenly way better about being done here. I like horror so much, but at the same time, I'm not really, like, built for it. Because I'm a little bit of a baby boo when it comes to this sort of thing. Like, the, like I unloaded a full... <laughs> all my ammo into that one thing. It probably didn't even take that many shots, or wasn't supposed to. Ah. Can I just... Oh, and there I go. I'm wasting ammo. That's gonna be a uh, reoccurring theme. Goo goo gaga? Goo goo gaga? Oh, look, we're on the other side. What's in here? Hello? It's a little peaceful now. I feel a little bit more like, oh, pick locks set. 
Don't know what those sounds are about, but I guess that's okay. A lot of books on subway utilities. A few books on locksmithing. Well, I'm a master locksmith, if you didn't know. So we're just gonna go get this get this deal. Apparently I can just kill anything that comes at me, which I kinda like the theme of. Um, if you give me a gun, I, I'm, I'm definitely gonna have a way better time in, in a game, just because I won't be as uh, quite, quite, just quite as scared. Sometimes I feel like some of these games overdo it with like the fear thing, because I, I can't take it sometimes. Oh. Oh, oh, yes, please. Yes, please. Oh, that's so nice. I want to save. That's what I want. Is this a save? Broken. Hmm. Oh. We can open the door now. We can open the door. Hello? Ah, it's just, it's it's a time thing. It just takes time. It just takes time. <laughs> Look at me being silly, thinking there's some... When I turn that off, it's gonna get crazy, man. It's gonna get crazy in here. I don't know where I'm going, though, is the issue. Oh! She's... Boop! Oh! Why does this someone locked this on me? Ridiculous, even. I would say, let me out. Okay. This lets me one tap them, though. I'm making an educated assumption that I'm supposed to go this way. Oh my goodness. Oh, okay. Here we are. I get so discombobulated in these games, guys. Truly. Yeah, I didn't talk about it much, but I just fist fought uh, Ghost Chica over there. We had a fist fight. I won. Go figure. Uh, she stood no chance at all, actually. And in fact, while I was uh, beating her with the sledgehammer, I was uh, telling her how nobody loves her. Um, I'm sure that's how she started in this way, in this, uh, in this path. Uh, stealing Corgi from me. Solicitor. A soliciting my dog. Not okay. Also not okay how much ammo I used. I blame having to go to the bathroom. Ah, oh, that's nice. I feel so, oh, I feel so safe in here. Okay, let's go. Oh, this is kind of fun in here. The Skeleton King, Baghdadi's Burger Bar. Ah, lock picks. This is a fun little room. If I had to live in a metro, I, I think I would want this room here. It's probably like really stale in here. You know what I mean? Stale. Oh no. Oh no. Oh. Huh. That's gonna lock. Baba B. Ah. Oh, it's right here then. I think uh, I'll I'll pistol it up. Come on! Oh, it's locked. I call it locked. Go, 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 go. Running through the tunnels. How fun! I I know this might be disorientating. If it's too disorienting, I'm gonna give you guys like a picture of a kitten. To keep you company. <laughs> it is a bit uh, disorienting at times. Oh! Clap, son. Scared of what? Not me, not this guy. Ain't. Ain't. No, no, no. Oh! Oh! Okay, come on! <laughs> come on, open up! Come on! Okay, <laughs> don't ever do that to me again. Don't ever do that. Oh, it's it's, it's locked. <laughs> okay. Ah. Oh. oh, I'm not out yet. I'm not out yet. Okay. I'm out. I'm out. Oh my goodness. 
I'm I'm safe. I'm gonna go save immediately. Google. So now I don't know what I'm looking for, but we'll figure it out. Oh, wait a second. It's a tape. Oh no. I did not mean to do this to myself. I was gonna enjoy just like a little music or something, or some like voice acting. That no. Oh, ga ga goo goo. Send me <laughs> ah! a syllable, kung Ah, ah, ah. Oh, there's so many pieces of bread in here. <laughs> it's just. Oh, what is a man to do? Is this what they want to do with my sweet croissant? Unacceptable. <laughs> Pete is gonna be so happy about this. Uh, can I not open the doors for them? Corgi? Corgith? Oh. Oh. I have my croissant, my. I have the croissant. You're getting out of here, boy. Oh, these games are like. Sensory overload. I got the croissant out. Oh, here we are. Power's back on, son. To the train we go. Let them never say that I don't 100% my games. I'm a 100%er. Shugugu Gaga? <gasps> oh! Uh, she's all slow. Is she like melting? Get wrecked, son. Get lugered. Ah. Uh. This is the game, guys. Well, goodbye, sad woman. I, I hope you have a horrible time. Not the rats! <laughs> Not the rats! There's so many dead rats! Oh. Is it the same? He makes me feel so much better sometimes, but I worry that I'm not good enough. He wants me to lose weight, and I'm really trying. But it's just so difficult. I look in the mirror and nothing's changed. Have you tried starvation? Have you tried body dysmorphia? <laughs> don't. Don't. <laughs> don't. Uh, I'm just messing. I'm goofing around. Been a silly little goose. Well, my friends, that was part one of Lost and Vivo. We're gonna find Corgi. We're going to find Corgi. And uh, I'll see you next time. Uh, it's, it's pretty fun. I like it. Doo. Ciao. Welcome back to Vivo. We're still on the train. I don't know where we're going. Oh, 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 Gurger Gaga, my rat. Pe uh, 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 Gaga Goo Goo. I got a gun. I will use it. I'm a violent person. Oh. Huh. Ah, the static stops me. My dog is so far away. I wish croissant were- wait. Oh. <gasps> A safe space! Gaga ba yet to- I- I think. I- I don't quite know where Fingerface is. I'm- I'm curious. This game seems like a lot bigger than I, uh, expected it to be. Like, a lot. Oh, would you look at these cute little faces. Broken. Oh. 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 Yeah. 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 Look at it go. Yeah. Now what's over here? That door scares me. I'm going over here. Hello. Ooh. 
What is bleach? Don't mind if I do. These floors could use. Oh! Oh! I spilled my gummies. to do this stuff while I feel spicy because if, if I like keep playing I like warm up to the horror it doesn't <laughs> Don't. nope I'm not looking at myself you can't make me look at myself oh I'm getting beaten by mirrors holy cow self-esteem getting violated is what's happening can I just oh haha -ha. Get. Okay. Oh. Get. Break. My self-esteem is fine, I swear. You, I, I just blew this up. Is this me? I think I blew up. I'm always a... Gross. Uh-huh. Oh. Oops. <laughs> Ooh. I did not know that this was a first-person shooter. Combat game. Cod. Cod 2. Cut four, cut five. Okay, you know what? Ah, oh. I had to Glock and Rarium, guys. I had to do it. The Grand Bolador, my worst enemy, a mirror. So I, I know in hindsight that the last sort of level oof, was about um, weight issues. She couldn't lose weight, so she uh, something about this train unnerves me. And it's blocking the tunnel. Uh-huh. Well, they gave us the answer. That train there, it unnerves us. Page one. Life was too harsh. Love was lost forevermore. They hung from a ceiling fan, staring at the floor. It's page one. So I, I'm pretty convinced that, like... <gasps> oh! To, um, mm. turn around. Ah! Don't hit me! Don't hit me! Ah! Oh, I'm getting beaten by a train. Chill. Woo! <laughs> the train's trying to beat me. Oh, how horrible! Let me through, please. Oh my goodness, um, it's only like slightly stressful. I'm kind of, so I got man, what is that? Choo choo brother. Okay, now I gotta go fist, gotta go fist fight more mirrors. I don't even remember what I was saying, that cracks me up. That doesn't freak me out too bad, I'll tell you what freaked me out. Um. The dog. I think it's the only time I've like scream screamed. And that, that like just joker at the beginning of the game who just tried to jump me for staring at his microwaved pizza. He he kinda spooked me a bit. Guess don't act up now. Honestly, he makes me feel kinda safe because I just know he's out there. Does that ever like knowing where the bad guy is is like half the horror. Like, if you manage to know, uh, which raises a question. Let's chat. We're going to chat. little TED Talk here. Um, how do you feel about, like, Lovecrafting horror? Because, like, tentacles don't scare me, but the idea of not knowing is... Oh, uh, 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 open up. Are you pooping? Are you pooping in there, man? Are you pooping? That's what public school in America feels like. Um, oh, my goodness. I just am so happy that it gave me a gun. It's not a horror game anymore. It's just... Whatever that is. Uh oh, look, I lunge forward when I use it. 
Well, I guess we got a knife now. There's really nothing to be scared of, you know, since I can stab it. Hmm. Hello? Ladies? Anyone present? I'm coming hence and hither. No jumpy business. Remember, guys, check all the souls. Okay, horror. Is it... Like, it's obviously... Oh, look at those rants. Uh, it's obviously scarier. If you don't know what's going on, or like, what's hunting you. Page two, life was too harsh. And a bridge was close by. They sank in the water. Gaping for the sky. Was their mouth open? Did they guzzle up that water? I suspect the puzzle. Of which I'm not the best at puzzles. Um... I should have wrote down these clues. Because I'm thinking, see the little faces? With a sideways stare. One, two, three. Is that sideways? Yeah. There. You were just down. Yeah, sad. Look at that. Smart am I? Okay, well, let's pretend that you're down. I know one of them had to be down. Now you are probably up. Never mind. Oh, down, up, other direction. Whoa, <gasps> their throats are slit. I figured it out, guys. I did the puzzle. Oh, I was thirsty. Sometimes you just gotta gerbil it up, you know? This is the point where you're actually just like stuck in the... Oh. Oh, I love crawling in these. Oh my goodness, just absolute pooper shooter. I feel like a slithering worm. Doily, are you here? So far I haven't been violently accosted in the pooper shoots. But you know, it's probably gonna change out oh, this room's big. Not a fan of that. Save room, please? Honestly, this is like a worse back rooms. Ah! Oh, what's that taking me? Oh, it's just leeches! Oh, the pooper shooter's not safe anymore! Remember, just keep running. The health in this game is weird. I don't... Oh! Oh, oh, oh! Crack tot tot! What they even doing? What are you doing? Do you mean... Oh, no. Oh, no rat. What they even doing? They're picking a... Okay. I'll take it. Thank you. Oh, it looks so safe in here. This. Let me in. Oh. oh. Generous saves. I love. I. I love a game with generous saves. Note to self: if I see this extra point for uh, generous saves, uh, it really adds to the fun, not the horror. Just having a hard game. It makes you want to cry and like pee a little bit. All he talks about is how ugly I've become. How ugly I'm going to be. He tells me he's leaving. I feel so... Blah, 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 blah. He hates me now. And I have all this responsibility. All because of this parasite. <gasps> I didn't think this would happen. I just did what I was told. I wanted him to be happy. Oh no! I know what this is about. Someone's pregnant. Oh! 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 Don't! Oh, I'm getting wormed! Oh, is this a boss fight? Oh. <laughs> get wrecked. Call me playing parrot because <laughs> I'm here to get rid of this thing. Oh, I know. The super special kitchen knife will do it. Oh. Health in this game is weird. I like it. Ugh. Okay, guys, we got to pop the lock in the Rari. 
just running around in a circle. It can't even touch me. I'm not even scared of this game anymore. Horror, way down. We'll see. Maybe Finger Face can pull it back. Oh. Oh. I don't know what that was, but it attacked me. Oh. So, how are you feeling? I feel like everyone hates me, and I hate myself. Your sense of self-worth is too influenced by body shape and weight. You don't judge others so harshly. You have worth. You have beauty. But you are unable to see it. Your vision of yourself is distorted. Then how should I fix it? If I can't fix my body, then how do I fix my vision of myself? We are working together to fix it. But I will also write you a refill for your fluxetine. Drugs. Drugs. That's often the solution. Um, I shouldn't say that. It's a pretty heavy game, honestly. Tackling some heavy comments. Because uh, that there is a... Uh, yeah, we'll help you, but here's your drugs. Um, can I go fight the... The worm? Was I supposed to perish? I believe I was. Hmm. I unloaded so much ammo, I should have just let them get me. Remember, guys, the next time you get attacked by, uh... Whatever that was. Um... <laughs> like an uncircumcised penis. Uh... Bring your safety. Your, uh, your whistle. Your whistle will keep you safe. Okay. We have a choice to make. Ugu Gaga, BB Ba, or... <gasps> I'm gonna go for Gugu Ba Ba BB Ba. Wait, we shouldn't judge things by their appearances. I'm making a big gamble here. <laughs> it's probably pretty straightforward. It's probably like, yep, yeah, if you go this way, <laughs> is waiting for you. We'll have a great time, though. It's all fun here. So I've entered that stage of the, uh... Hmm. Green's gone. I've entered that stage of the, the horror where, uh... I feel like full of myself. Like, yeah, something chasing me like would stress me out, but um, I don't think I would necessarily be frightened of it. Oh, it did the thing. Oh, why did I take it? I thought about shooting it. Yeah. Ew, ew, ew. Woo! Did I pass? What's going on, man? What's going on? It's getting kind of wild in here. It's a torn piece of my dog's leash. <gasps> Doily. Why? I feel like I made the right choice for some reason. Ha. Huh. We'll see. We're obviously dealing with like trauma. Like tra traumatic uh, little spirits. So all these like things we're dealing with is like people's trauma. And I guess our character has the dog because it had a little vest on it too. So it must be like some sort of um, support animal in some capacity. Note is from Doily. I waited in the dark for so long. I lashed out against anyone who got close, but someone kept pushing me into the light. It hurt me for a while. It doesn't hurt anymore. I think I got the good ending for her. Maybe it's because I kept the baby and I didn't unload my Luger into it. Like, I thought about doing, uh, not... Motivational. Doily! I thought about shooting the baby, but I didn't. Well, it, it hardly looked like one, but I guess it's like point of view, you know? To someone who doesn't want it, that might be what the baby looks like to them. Look at it getting all deep. Holy rapture. Huh. I want to see what. Oh. 
Oh, I didn't go down the hole. Meh. Another puzzle. How fun. Now, I do like that I can, like, shoot everything. The thing I, I simply cannot do, guys, is, like, avoiding enemies you can't kill. Um, that's really rough on me. Th those are horror games I, I, I'm not sure I ever really am able quite to play. Huh. Well, this is definitely a... Oh, it makes us turn around. Now our butt's open to whoever decides that, uh... They want to have a gander. No ganders here. Oh. Okay, the horror is back. <gasps> Doily! Oh! Okay. Okay, that's a little spooky. Just a bit. Come on, man. I'll fight all of you. It's all mindset. Please, game developer. Do not make me have to hide from something. I will not be happy about it. I'll not be happy at all. Oh. Beetle emblem. Mine access key. Yay. So, how much you want to bet when I go back through that door, I'm going to have to take those little hallways. First someone's to the left. Let's get this bread. I'm totally right. What is that? Ooh. Okay, fine. You know what? You know what? We're not fighting the thing. We're running. I'm a runner. I run from things. Come on, climb the ladder. I assume it can climb the ladder. I'm not very scared by it. It's, uh, it's whatevs. Ooh. I think truly the second the second that like I saw the first ghost I was suddenly like far less uh, horrified by the game oh hi we're being watched is this canon is this real or is this all just like subliminal I know this says dead end but I don't believe it Never mind, I believe it. Okay. <laughs> oh, these are rough right here. Okay. Just a few months. I'm kind of amazed that I can like just choose to Glock and Rari these things. That's kind of freaky. Look at that. It's crawling. It's got doily all on it. Hey, Doily. It's catching up. It's catching up. You get back down there. Oh. Now you hold your horses, mister. I don't know who you are, what you think you're doing. Here, look. Open the door. <gasps> Feeling good today, Mr. Brundle, Personal Archive 87, 86. <laughs> Feeling good about today. Progress continues almost at an alarming rate, given how theoretical this all should be. Today we had one of the smaller rodents continue to move for almost two hours after all of its blood had been drained and replaced with mixed PA 22-12-15. Sounds like a name of my friend. Because I want to know. I really goofed up there. What is that supposed to be? It's a rat? Dr. Pekini. P 
PA-66, my dreams have found their savior. A dark creature swabbed in dirty robes now lives within them. They eat the rats and silence the screaming. Soon I'll begin work. Not this filthy government's rat work, but my true work. I will give birth to my savior so they can silence everything. I think we're still dealing with the paranoia person. No holds bars. Check. Double gritty, as they say. Oh, it's Dr. Pacini's room. Dr. Pacini, we just read your letter. Uh, we're coming to do a uh, health checkup to see how you're doing. How you're faring? Pacini, 65. Shrieks and squeals are all that I hear. My dreams are infested with these rats. If only they knew that we are going to make them into something beautiful. If they knew that they had the capacity to, they would respect me. But no, it's nothing but screams and wailing. I can't sleep. I can only think. Even when I'm further away than the sound should possibly travel, I still hear them. Brum, 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 brum. Oh, how the heart keeps going. All oh, the rats. I knew it would catch up. There are too many rats down here. It's an alarming amount. An alarming amount. Well, that looks like the way forward. Lab. Oh, broken. Lab. It lets me in. Holy! Put it out of its misery. Put it right out of its misery. And now it's dead. And now we're free. Put that thing out of its misery. What? The? I don't do the hunched over nonsense. See, if I didn't have a gun, I'd be horrified. Major horror points lost on the firearms. I appreciate it, though. The fun fact that goes way up. PA88. I'm beginning to question my fellow scientist ethics. If we can truly call any of this science anymore, I fear we're all stumbling into something dark. And with each breakthrough, my fear grows. I don't know how they'll react when we inevitably hit a dead end with these experiments. Well, I think we've met it. Uh, are they trying to do this to Doily? Open. Rats? Rats? Er oh, hi. Doll head picked up. Don't know if that was a good idea. Guess we'll find out. I'm glad I can like effectively fist fight anything in this game. Oh, no, no back touchies. Look at that thing. It's awful. No back touchies. Ugh. I want to make like a three-year-old play this game. Do not. Dr. Brundle, today I questioned the higher staff just on how far they think we can go with these experiments. Dr. Piccini took hold of me and brought me into one of the off-limit rooms and showed me something I don't fully understand. Maybe he was playing an elaborate or inappropriate prank. Panici told me it was his other pet project and assured me that the work we're doing is of great importance. Rat babies? That's what they're doing. That's what it looks like to me. It looks like rat babies, what it looks like. I'll take it, though. You know, I... <laughs> I think I'd evolve too if I was being turned into these horrible things. Oh. What a horrible... I don't like it in here. Holding one. Lockers, lab one. We're almost out. <gasps> Break it! Oh! It's me! Who knew? I did not expect that. The locked door. Dr. Piccini, my dear savior, is going growing every day i started stealing some of the rats from their tiny safe cages and put them in the hole with soratrius at first i wasn't sure if they would do anything but once i left and came back the rats were gone and only traces of the rats left was a lipstick smear of blood on soratrius's dog 
I'm still in that. Oh, look, another thing. We have done it. I have to get out of here as soon as I can. These are not creations that should exist. I don't know if we screwed something up along the way or this was the only possible outcome. I'm about to get chased by Filthy Frank, I think, is what is about to happen to me. Um. Oh, it only gets stunned! It only gets stunned! Oh! Run for your lives! Okay. Can we loop it? Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna run to the end of the hall. I'm gonna unload a little bit on it. Just, okay, when you shoot it, it runs. When you shoot it, it runs. I don't like these things at all, man. This is a very good time, you know what I mean? We're gonna take some hits, but we're doing it. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Success, it says. The eyes have been eaten out. Oh. I can't get out of here. The halls are full of them. They are worshipping Pacini's messed up pet. They swarm around just like the rats. Did I run all the way over here? Oh. I thought it was his eyeball, but it is but a trackpad. Well, what the? What? Did you guys saw that, right? Look at that. That ain't a bug, is it? No. Nah. That has to be intentional. I have to feed his body to the rats. Get out of my way. Get out of my way. Don't look at me. I'm not here. I'm not here. Don't look at me. Don't look at me. I'm not here. I'm coming to feed you, Mr. Krabs. Is it in... <laughs> I've got a whole body in my inventory. <laughs> Just lugging a piggyback style, a little eyeless. Eyeless is. Well, Corgi, Yorgi, Doily! Doily dog. Danny? Your name's Danny. Fine. No way. Doily, is that really you? How did you live this long? I don't care what his name is. His name's Doily, you hear me? Doily. Oh, I can't express to you like how happy I am to see this dog. But now the far more stressful part of the game is getting this dog out of here without him dying a horrible death. Doily? Oh. What is that, Doily? Is that a dark omen of the future? Future impending doom? Well, don't you worry, Doily. I may have missed a tape, but I got this body. A bunch of water is gonna flush in, isn't it? Doily? Really? What do you mean I can't go down there? Maybe we need to lose some weight. There's only one way out, and that's through the lab. I don't have a map of this area. Lockpick's broken. Okay. Come on, man. I'm filling it. Let's cook. You want to play, Dr. Pinocchio? I'll bag.
I'm coming back for this body. I just gotta open the door and I'll come right back for you, man. Don't worry, I'm not leaving you here. Nobody left behind at this point. That includes Doji the dog, Doily. My little Doily do. Don't worry, I'm coming back, Mr. Uh, Pinoch. I'm gonna need your body, I'm pretty sure. Hmm. Well, whatever the reason, I can't pick him up anymore. I'm gonna try one. You come back here! You come back here, you don't get away from me! I'm almost out of here, but Panichi's pet is in the warehouse by the emergency exit. It won't move while I'm staring at it, but when I try to look away, it seems to reappear somewhere within a closer radius. If someone finds this, please be careful as the creature may still be around. Well, weeping angel. We got ourselves a weeping angel, my friends. But don't worry. We got the eyeless man to save us. Well, let's go enjoy our fate. I think it's in here. Oh. Well, that's it, isn't it? Well, I mean, I had to give it a try, didn't I? Now, the real horror is if anything else is in the space. But it does make for tricky gameplay. Okay, I can still... So it doesn't attack if you keep an eye on it. Oh. Nothing. Nothing in the meat. Bye. So it's just everything else in this game. They all want my gummies. Missing left eye picked up. Ha! Huh. Looks like his intensity has increased, my friends. Ha. Huh. He's probably gonna try to actually eat me this time. Before it was just play. He was just playing. Now he's hungry. I'm gonna save. <laughs> Oh, Sakura Blue. Sakura Blue Blop Blop. Ugu Gaga? What even is that supposed to mean? So help me. not playing by the same rules anymore. We're in the part of the game where we don't stop running. We're gonna find the other eyeball. <laughs> I'm so confused. I have no idea what I'm doing or where I'm going. I just know I'm going somewhere. And there's an angry eyeball following me.
Kind of peaceful. I'm enjoying myself with this. What the? What the? No. This is bull. Don't buy it. I don't believe it. I don't believe it for a second. Nonsense. Nonsense. I don't buy it. Uh-uh. It's not real. You let me out. I need doily. I need doily. You let me out of here. I'm not leaving without doily. You let me out of here now. You let me out of there. Oh, Doily. No. I need him. This is unacceptable. That's what this is. Yeah, I don't believe it. Look, it's shaking. Motion capture by Lord Caber. <laughs> That's me. Hello, blood. Oh, okay, I knew it. I knew that wasn't it. Quasimodo. That's my friend. Time is late. I'm coughing up bugs. Savior of rats. So, Tyrus. Yeah, we don't get to leave. You get away from me. I see you. Thirst for eyes is an unquenchable hunger. Come taste my rock and rari. You think you're something special. I'm something special. You are just an imitation. You want eyes, son? I'll give you all the eyes you ever need, son. Them fighting words. Now I'm talking crap. We got the save right here. For a second, I was like, what's going on, man? Whoa, 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 man. Wait, 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 wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. I, once again, I did not get any cool tapes. I should be fu Aw, look at this. Look at this. Look how nice it is in here. Oh, that's great. Look, a map of the horror. Save. Game, game. Look, there's some floppy drives in here. We'll get it. We're going to get this, bruvs. Although I think I'm going to... No. Let me back in. Okay, good. I wasn't ready to leave. I need to read this note. If the power goes out on the tracks, you have to reboot the whole system. In order to do that, go to each section and turn off the breaker boxes. Then come back here and restart the system. I've barely been able to keep the power on. So that's about all the advice besides giving up that I can give. Huh. Wasn't that horrifying, my friends? That was a message to us. So we either do this or we give up. But I've never given up on anything in my life. And I'm not giving up on doily now. Mm -hmm. Let's get this bread. Let's get these absolute barnacles. Let's strategize. Let's go right first. Gonna just hit that breaker real fast. I don't know what G means. Okay, bros, what's cooking? I'm here for doily. I'm not leaving until I get the Only 
one way to go. The path of uh, great tears and crying. Oh, look, I do love a linear game. Sometimes I just don't have the power to think for myself. It's a generator, right? Huh. Huh. Not sure what that means, but, you know, we'll try our best to find out. Spooky Stories for Kids, Volume 1. Once there lived a nasty old man in a nasty old house. The nasty old man wouldn't go outside. The nasty old man wouldn't play. He sat in his tub and soaked in the water all day. Just him and his music, enjoying the water. Even though it was nasty and green, he soaked all day and every night. But he never tried to get clean. But one day, the old man couldn't find his music. His radio was all filled with static. He twisted and turned and tried all the stations, and the thing got a little dramatic. His radio fell down into the water, and he missed the off switch. The old story goes that if you visit his house, his nasty old corpse will still twitch. Egad! Now, friends, that's not a very happy story to be telling people. What even the crap is that? Like, what is this? What am I supposed to... <laughs> Maybe not, like, the best lesson to be had, my friends, but... Um, that thing needed to go. You saw it, didn't you? Yeah, we're not... Finger face is here. Finger face is here. Finger face is here. Finger face is here. Okay, I I'm gonna tell you what. I I kind of already know how this is supposed to end. I can only make a guess. Here, here's what's gonna. Oh, he's kind of fast. He's kind of fast. He's kind of fast. Okay, I can't look at finger face anymore. Here's my 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 large cognitive brain functioning. Oh, he's fast. I don't like how fast he is. Okay, that's pretty spooky, but... Oh, get wrecked! Oh, you thought you were slick! Hallelujah, finger face is here. He's here to touch your face and touch your rear. Oh, oh, and he scurried away. I guess go right. We'll see. Luckily, I was able to figure that out somewhat quickly. I didn't need too much cognitive function for that one. Spooky stories for kids, volume two. Once there lived a nice man with his nice old dog. <gasps> The nice man was content, just him and his dog, watching the years pass by. His house was old and deep in the woods, with a little blue patch of sky. One night, the nice man was out walking his dog, as was his nightly habit. But then the dog got out of his leash to quickly chase after a rabbit. The night sky was dark, just barely lit, so the nice man was filled with worry. But then the old dog yelped and ran inside as if it was in a hurry. The nice man went inside and locked up, his worries for now put to bed. But then, out of the window, he saw his dog, but its skin had been shed. That's horrifying! Holy cow, guys! Do you think you're getting better? Does doing this even have a purpose? Oh no! 
Well, I kind of don't want to kill him now. Do I have to kill him? Fine. He talked me out of it with his logical reasoning. I'll go the other way. Let's see if I can go that way the first. If I can't, then obviously I'm just, yeah. Okay. Sorry, bud. You're getting stabbed. <laughs> the escalation, I know. It's, it's immediate. Okay, I can only go forward. No lights. <gasps> I'm doily. That's not me. Oh, bark. I do bark. What dog? I'm just a little dog. <laughs> I don't think I appreciate playing the dog. It makes me sad. And it's also very, like, dizzy inducing. Oh. Oh, a bright tunnel. Gotta like these. I hope I can, like, find some, like, pile of abysmal to just, like, start chewing at. It's doily. I'm not drowning doily. Oh! 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 Oh, unacceptable action! I've made a mistake. I've made a mild mistake. It's too late for that. Oh no! I was doily! Okay, fine, son. <sighs> okay, fine, I'll drown my dog. Hey, bud. Spooky Stories Volume 3. Once there lived a great old beast in a great old wood. The great old beast would attack the town and carry young children away. It screamed and it howled from inside the woods each night and every day. So one night the townsfolk hatched a plan to slay the beast once and for all. They snuck up close while it slept under a tree, and they made it fall. It growled and hissed, not moving an inch since the fallen tree held it down. The warriors fought and stabbed the old beast to finally save the town. But the stories go that if you visit the woods, that under a great fallen oak, the great old beast isn't dead at all. It just still hasn't woke. That's scary. I'm your identity. I'm your crutch. You used to cling to me like a parasite. I know you better than anyone, and I know you're weak. You'll come right back. Look in the Rory, mate! That's how I feel about that. Okay. Is dumping. He's behind me. He's totally behind me, isn't he? I memorized the map, though. Ha, ha. I thought I memorized the map. It's a dead end. Oh. Oh, I've been hit. I've been assailed and assaulted. Uh, what is this supposed to be, man? It's supposed to be the way through. I have been done dirty. I mean, I'm not scared. Not scared at all. Why would I be scared of this thing? It's, uh... Okay, I understand. A button I pressed opened the thing. Okay, I don't understand. I don't understand at all. Let me go press the button again. You know, I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to drop that heavy door on it. I'm gonna give it the old one, two katoofers. I'm gonna open it and then I'm gonna like hop right back through. And it's gonna be great. 
Look at this. You're gonna love this. Okay. Fine. Oh! Oh, it's so dark in here. Where's the way out? Okay. Oh. I think I, I gotta go do it again. Huh. Come on, dude. Come on. Oh! None of that, so <laughs> Oh, no, that was supposed to be about, but we ain't here for it. I'm here for doily. That was kind of a good old run around the elbow to reach the, the canoodle. That's definitely what that was. But I feel I feel safe now. I feel free. Finger face was like the only thing that like kind of spooked me out. He was creepy, don't get me wrong, but... but. Um, he was really easy to avoid. I think if I had, like, health, that would have made that, like, way more stressful. This is where it came from. Well, into the pit. I hope there's not a, a second thingy face, you know. Doggy? I feel committed to finishing. It's near, it's near my bedtime. It's a way out. I can't. I have to get doily. Surely leaving the dog isn't the bad, like keeping the dog isn't the bad ending. Surely it's a dog. It's always good to go for the dog. But I chose dog. Doge. Who wouldn't though? Who wouldn't choose doge? Don't you say you would. I bet some of you out there say you would. No, you wouldn't. Doge is doge. Dog. And I'm saving my dog, so help me. I have like an inner feeling that the end is near, you know? Like we've been through a journey, a journey, a journey of sorts. Um, but I feel in my heart that this is about to come to an end. What we have here. It's with great emotion I go through this door because I'm about to... What even are you? Okay, you're getting the shotgun. We're not playing. I don't know what you are. I'm here for my dog. It's the end of the movie. It's the end of the movie where I man up and face the enemy. We're running. We're at that part of the game. If we just keep moving, nothing will hurt us. Dog? Please, dog. Dog, please, please. I just want my dog. <laughs> Doily. Doily. I 
have to go forward. Don't you ever go down. <laughs> Don't you ever go down again. I thought the dog was a bad thing. I thought the dog was a bad thing for at the, at the end. Achieve the good ending. I got the good end. You escaped the confines of the sewer and reunited with your dog. You felt that your experience has changed who you are and that the barriers of life that once restricted and intimidated you have now fallen away. You've been to hell and back, confronted your fears and gotten stronger. And we saved Doily the dog. The doge. We got the good ending. First try. I didn't have to go back and crawl through the game again. I hate doing it. Um, it was fun. It was fun. It, it lacked difficulty because if it had any difficulty at all, I would have lost uh, a lot. Uh, but I didn't lose a lot. Um, That was great fun. I don't really get the full point. Like, I get the gist, like, uh, overcoming trauma and such and moving forward. Um, and even, like, the thing about, like, the dog. The dog was there for you at the end. But you had to move forward without him. Ah, look at that. Deeper meaning. Who would have thought it? Here at the Crooked Caber, we have deep thoughts. I promise. I liked it. I'm going to sit through the... Um, Five thousand three hundred and five dollars. Holy cow. It cost that much to make this I guess it was a pretty decent game. I Was so happy they gave me a gun if I didn't have a gun um, You guys would have seen me just like sprint through the whole game like I did there at the end Because um, I cannot help myself if, if I get chased by too much couldn't be me I, I'm still not sure about like the uncircumcised penis monster um, Like I get I think that was the fetus but I think I like made the right choice by taking the baby. We'll, we'll see. I'm, I'm like gonna look through a bunch. Cause, holy Chris, man, look at all these people. Oh, these are the donors. Oh dear, this is gonna go forever, isn't it? You know what? I got time. I'll cut. I'll cut if it lasts too long. Um. Oh. But so, my friends, thank you again for joining me on the Crooked Caber. Until next time.